NLEX made quite a stir by dominating a heavily favored opponent in their very first game. It's now a matter of the Road Warriors aiming to raise more eyebrows when they tangle with an undermanned Northport side Sunday in the PBA Governor's Cup at the Eners Center in Antipolo. A follow-up victory by NLEX on its 10390 shocker over TNT just last Friday would give it the early lead in the season-ending tourney. Not bad at all for practically the same team that wound up second to last in the recent Commissioner's Cup. What makes the win more impressive is the fact the Road Warriors fashioned it despite the absence of head coach Yang Giao and veteran center Asi Tolava, both with the national team seeing action in the Asian Games in Indonesia. Northport, formerly known as Global Port, also has Stanley Pringle on loan to the Nationals and now also have to see action minus the injured Sean Anthony. Still, Batang peer coach Pito Gerencio maintains his team is ready to go. And LEX played a good game against TNT last night. Their import is strong, said Gerencio on the eve of the match. We have to play our A game tomorrow to beat an LEX. Indeed, Olu Asheolu was suffering from a slight paddle or tendon tear but still managed to scatter 33 points, 23 rebounds and 3 assists against TNT. It was not an all-Asheolu show for NLEX, however. Mark Tallow picked up in the late stages of the last conference to help make up for the absence of backcourtman Kevin Alas, injury, and Kiefer Ravina, suspended, continued to impress with 16 points. Team captain Larry Fonasier chipped in 14 points and 4 rebounds, while new acquisitions Philip Panyamagan and Bong Galanza quickly made an impact for the Road Warriors by combining for 20 points and shoring up the squad's perimeter defense. A glimpse of how Rashid Woods has fit in with Northport's locals, now led mainly by Nico Ellard, Jonathan Gray, Ryan Arana, Gabby Espinas and Bradwin Ginto, should be one of the sidelights of the match.